we are here with fitness coach Marlo Ellis. Marlo, this looks a little frightening to me. Yeah, this is one of my favorite series of movements because this is the <laughs> military is. boot camp movement. And I love military boot camp because what it does is it gets you doing all kinds of crazy, wacky stuff that you might not normally do in a gym environment, right? So you have to have some of the tools to do that. So we have here um, a smaller, I think this, this is about a 60, 60 pound uh, oh, boxing bag. It's the okay? And what you're gonna do is you're gonna do what I call um, a dead man. Okay? Dead man, okay. Dead man. Okay. All right. So what you're going to do is you're going to pick it up from the bottom, all right, and you're going to pop it up on your shoulder like you're carrying a dead guy. Okay. I don't think there's any grace. This is what they do this. on the military fields. Here you go. <laughs> yep. And there's nobody there to hit. Awesome. Okay. okay now now get there. your core nice and tight, and I'm going to have you do some walking lunges forward. So now oh. we're working on core strength, but we're also going to engage her lower body and get that leg strength in there. So now we're adding that extra weight. Awesome, Jan. I thought I just had to pick up the bag. Perfect. No way. So this is a kind of movement that, um, it's a compound movement, so she's got lots of different things going on here. Her full body is engaged. So when you do this for 40 seconds, you really feel it. <laughs> How do your legs feel, Janice? Well, I can say they're pretty sore, and another part of my body is very sore as well. My your glutes? glutes? Oh, yeah. Awesome. Well, that's what, we like that. That's what we like to do. That's fun stuff. Okay, so they're probably going to get a little bit sore before we're over. Okay, but this is an awesome military movement as well. Okay. This is a sandbag squat. All right? That so I love sandbag. the sandbags because you can throw a different weight in them, so you can adjust them based on people's ability. Okay. okay? You can see that they have the two little handles at the top. I want you to come down, and you're going to swing that bag and cradle it in your arms. And then you're going to come down and do a full squat. And don't hit yourself in the face. Try not to bag. knock yourself out. Okay. There you go. And then you drop it back. Oh. Good. And then bring it back up. And squat. So the goal here, yeah, keep going. The goal here is to kind of not let it flick you, but to actually control the movement of the bag. Awesome. Okay, now you tell me now. <laughs> and the thing about the bag is that it's awkward, right? Like the weight's not evenly distributed because that's not realistic if you're in a military situation. So what they're doing is trying to give you kind of awkwardness to, and then you have to compensate in different ways. Okay, one more. Beautiful. Good. One more squat. Oh. <laughs> squat. Misbehavior. Okay, with, with the bag. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, now with there is one more thing that we can add to this, right? That's right. So I now can't wait. we're going to take this to the next level and make it a little bit more metabolic. So you're going to do the sandbag squat, cradle it, come down, bring it back down. Okay. And make sure you don't flick it. You want to bring it down controlled and then you're going to thrust out in the back. Yep. And squat. Okay. Squat. Okay. And then drop it back down and then you're going to thrust out. There you go. Like a and then, exactly. So you're gonna just do a whole bunch of those consecutively. And when you when you land that bag, try not to come forward. You want to stay nice and strong. There you go. So you do those for 40 seconds. That's a whole other level of butt kicking, right? Because now you're throwing in the metabolic part as well as the lower body. Okay. So the sandbag is another great tool. Good job, Janice. Well, no, <laughs> I'm tired. She's like, I'm done. That was good. If you'd like any information on any moves we did today. We need an oxygen mask that drops down from the ceiling. That obviously gets your heart rate up quite, yeah, for quite sure. quickly. Right. Uh, you can contact Marla through the website and keep watching for more Body Sculpt with Marla Wells. Good job, guys.